And joining me now is John Sprouse, Managing Director for Technology, Media and Telecommunications for Deloitte. John, welcome, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Uh, we're here to talk about AI. Um, yeah. There's a lot of hype around it. Uh, it can be quite daunting for businesses. What are the first steps? You know, how can businesses get started with this? Yeah, we're, we're pretty practical about these things with our clients. Uh, usually clients we work with are, have a problem to solve, a uh, very specific problem uh, that they're facing. Uh, but really the, the promise of AI is that, that you can solve those immediate issues, but then you can also start thinking about innovative solutions. So uh, kind of the next step is to try to come up with those future, future ideas and the, those really innovative solutions. And the technologies allow you to do these things very quickly and, and prototype very quickly test them, try it again, and, and then release it to market. So uh, we're, we're kind of working with clients on both ends, and that's how companies can get started in this, in this AI world. And what kind of use cases are you seeing out there when you're talking to businesses and customers? Yeah, some, some examples that we're spending a lot of time on are definitely around the whole area of Internet of Things and enabling devices uh, and big, big equipment and being able to sense what's going on with that equipment, being able to monitor it proactively, uh, to keep service uh, uptime high, uh, dispatch repair people to, to service those, those big machines. Um, that's, that's a hot area for us. We're spending a lot of time on that with, with clients. We're also very active in the automotive industry and obviously a lot of changes when you talk about uh, self-driving cars or other technologies that are coming to the future and really getting personal, personal with, your, with your vehicle. And obviously you're, you're an open text partner. I mean, how are you an open text working together to help businesses use AI to solve their, their challenges? Yeah, we're really trying to um, establish the foundation of technologies with OpenText with our customers. So we start with building that, that layer of, of, of capabilities. And then now what we're doing is really trying to extract more value and more return on investment from those, from those capabilities and be able to do things like understand content and analytics that are, and actually are the content that's sitting in your system that you've already established in that first layer and being able to expand and build on it to do more interesting and innovative things with AI, with analytics, with other parts of, of the capabilities that OpenText brings. Mm -hmm. And a bit of uh, future gazing, uh, what do you see the next year or two for AI? What can businesses expect? Uh, I think you're going to see a lot of innovation and, and what we're hearing from clients is, is a real desire to move faster. Uh, and so we're really seeing a lot of innovation around um, in Internet of Things, combining that with big data, uh, getting clients getting their hands around big data and all the, the data they have in their organization and kind of unlocking it and freeing it up to be able to put better analytics on top of it. And there seems to be a new sense of urgency, whether it's, whether it's just the competitive environment or the speed at which, which uh, businesses are moving these days. Um, that, that there seems to be a new urgency from our clients at, at wanting to move faster into those end future future solutions, innovative solutions. Fascinating stuff, thank you very much John. You bet, thank you.